Hi. Um, so I forgot to start filming. <laughs> When I started playing, I've been sitting here talking for the past half hour. I'm yawning now. I'm exhausted. Um, but I started making the plots for my first three villagers that are going to move in. Tom Nook here is yapping away, talking my ear off. Shut up. Um, why is he upset? Excuse me. Um, but we're gonna just go ahead and work on these plots part of me wants to use 10 tickets to see who we can get but another part of me is like let's just auto fill and then see what happens so we're gonna decide that together um right now we are making the items for my homes i know that i need two peach items which are the peach surprise box the peach chair and then there was another item but I forgot what it was. Poop. I think it was a pot, but I don't remember. Um, and so we're working on that. I already completed one of my homes. She's a queen. She's productive. I think it was a pot. I'm just going to go with pot. Um, and so we're getting ahead of it. My museum is also getting built. I already got that out of the way. I got the items that Blathers wanted, or rather the amount of fossils. If you can hear noise to my right, I apologize. My parents, um, love to make noise always. I live in a Latino household, Latino gang. You're, um, <gasps> That was unplanned. Oh no. Oh. Okay, let's just see who it is. One, two, three. Who's Ava? Who's Ava? Hold on. Keyboard ASMR, y'all. We're about to look up who Ava is because I have no clue. Is that a chicken? Oh, she's a normal chicken. Okay, I'm not mad about that. Ava's cute. She's okay. I'm not mad about that. Well, I guess we're just gonna do the autofill method then. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot that when you put the items that they move in. Crap. Well, there goes the plan for this video. Um, I'm a mess. How do y'all enjoy me? This is crazy. Um, this plot i don't remember who it is i think it might be the lazy yeah i think this is a lazy hay bed swing bench barrel got it um and so we gotta make the lazy's house and the peppies um for lazy and peppies i'm a little bit more picky than i am with normals because as many people i think agree in the animal crossing circle there's a lot of cute normal villagers not so many um lazy or peppy at least in my opinion i will say though in restarting all my islands and stuff what did they want hay bed hay bed swinging bench and barrel we don't have weed i think is what we need weeds weeds oh my god weeds not weed weeds youtube don't come after me please um mexican um and so we're gonna work on that I'm not making any sense. It's nine. It's 940 at night. I don't know why I decided to do this right now. I'm on crack. Call me. What's his name? The bald guy from Breaking Bad. My fault. Um, I love that show. What's the name? Heisenberg. There you go. Um, but yeah. And then I am I was hoping to be able to fit in like doing the campsite stuff while I was doing this as well. But I don't know if I'm going to have time for that. So that might have to be its own separate thing. Um, we'll see. We'll figure it out. Hello, what am I doing? Weeds. Okay, I need 20 clumps of weeds. I have plenty on this island. I haven't cleaned for shit. So this island's a mess. Look, there's 20 weeds right back there. Right with the pork a pig. Um, yeah. Oh, but the thing I was saying is in getting random villagers, I'm starting to like the uggo ones. The only exceptions to that are Al, we have Beef for Life, Jock, I hate you, um, I won't elaborate why, don't come after me, everyone is entitled, okay, you didn't take six months to kick someone off your island, and I mean in real time, even with time traveling and everything, this man would not leave, okay, I just hit my mic, I apologize, I'm, get I'm getting too passionate, I'm getting too passionate. 
But yeah, I can't stand that burb. Um, also, Al, the thing with Al, he just makes me sick. Like the color of him, he looks like mokos. He looks like boogers. And I just can't stand it. So it's not personal with him. It's just looks, which is kind of mean. But I can't get past it. So that's with him bob is also personal because even though bob is cute it took me eight months in real time even longer than jock the only reason i don't like jock is also because he was beefing with marshall and that's my boy um but it took me eight months to get that man off my island or something like that it took a very long time and so me and bob have issues um we tried working on him and we just couldn't we decided it was for the best if we just go our separate ways gotta go my own way as gabriella said in that one um high school musical song speaking of i know we're bouncing topic to topic but like y'all know how i am if y'all watch me y'all know how i am if you don't, hi, welcome in. The name's V, I'm 26, and I play what I want. Um, mostly Animal Crossing. Um, <laughs> oh, High School Musical. The thing that I was saying, in the first High School Musical movie, fun fact, Zac Efron didn't sing any of his songs. Spoiler alert, oops. Let's check what's in here. Wooden block stereo, wooden block table, wind flower wreath. Oh, I have to go get the flowers. Let's check the exterior then first. W iron garden chair, iron garden table, and birdhouse. Got it. Um, He didn't sing in the first movie. So in the second High School Musical, they were like, you got to sing your heart out, Zach. You got to get out there and just, just give it. Just give theater. Just give drama. And did that man give? He gave. He ate. He slayed. The way he was out there, he's like, everybody's always talking about me. He ate that. And I'm low-key going to watch High School Musical 2 tonight just to see that. And just to see um, them saying, I don't dance. I hope that's not the second one. In and out of the park. High School Musical, y'all, was a time. And anyone who tells you it wasn't good, they're a damn lie. Lying straight down to hell. Because that movie was it. Um, and I was actually reminiscing the other day because I've been in a, what I guess social media is calling a fruity, fr fruitager arrow era, I think is what it's called. I'm going to type it out on the screen here millennial pause for that um zillennial in my case um where you really reminisce on old things from when you were a child and one thing that actually really pushed me over the edge recently in a good way not a bad way i'm not going crazy <laughs> did his fishing rod just glitch hello um is my grandma actually gifted me this fish thing <gasps> hold on let's see who moved in one two three Who's Elmer? Like Elmer's glue? Hold on, y'all. I swear I play this game. Oh, he's not bad. He kind of just looks like a basic horse. That's not bad. Um, oh, but my grandma gifted me this like fish thing that reminds me a lot of like a, a fish tanks we had when we were kids. And it really threw me into this nostalgic loop and it made me realize one how old i'm becoming but how a lot of the things that we were like sold as futuristic when we were children are really now remnants of the past if you really think about it and that really sat with me and so i was sitting there in my thoughts and i went down this rabbit hole of all this fruit arrow stuff on tiktok and pinterest and now i want to redo my room but i'm also poor and i know y'all understand that dilemma so that's one of the places i'm at in life right now and what i'm really obsessed with other than all the other fifteen thousand things i've mentioned okay what is it that i need oh i need a vaulting pole for sure um and then what other items poop i'm trying to remember um i think they wanted a table and a stereo wasn't it i think and so we need to make a block toy from what i remember to make the other softwood stuff you have to make the block toy so 
There we go. We're gonna have the table, and then they're gonna have some music. Play some They Not Like Us on the radio. Oh my god, can we talk about that too as well? How with the music video and everything else, Kendrick has been nonstop bullying Drake, and I stand, first of all, considering the type of man that Drake is. Um... And the way that it extends past the hip hop culture, like the way that he bet against Argentina, I believe he bet on the Canadian team in the soccer games. I keep hitting my mic, I'm so sorry. And they dead ass when they won, played not like us and put that IG post up and they put it on TikTok. And they made a graphic that said not like us that's crazy when you have the argentinians coming after you that's when you know you're an op to everyone kendrick wasn't lying when he said i'm what the culture feeling because every culture is feeling him and not you drake that's crazy that's insane i know drake is crying that man aged like 20 years in the few months that kendrick has been dragging him also to change topics very quickly again but i'm so happy that i got wind flowers i was just really hoping not to get those one other flowers that are the flowers from um alice in wonderland i don't like those because of alice in wonderland they scare me so i'm glad i got wind flowers i was hoping i would get mums but these are okay i'm probably gonna work on picking these tonight um just so that I don't have a bunch of flowers all over my island. Why do you sit down like that? What is this? What's his name? I was about to say chops. Chips. No. Curly. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, let's craft this last item. And then we'll see who fails this last plot. Um, I'm excited. I'm eager to see who our peppy's gonna be. Again, this is another short video, but I figured y'all would enjoy um i like making the short form content especially right now as i previously updated um about my leg how it was kind of feeling pains a little bit update on that actually another update to the update um i've been having really really bad pains now and it's a type of pain that burns like it's hot um which is not good because it could be cartilage, it could be early signs of arthritis, it could be meniscus, it could be a ligament. And considering I've had surgery before, it could be so many different things. So I'm likely going to have to go back to my surgeon, which kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Um, you know, you do what you have to. And I'm going to figure it out. And I'll obviously, obviously, hello, obviously keep you all posted on how that goes. Um, but cross your fingers that there's nothing wrong with me. Um, uh, leave me alone. I hate this guy. Uh, just kidding. I feel really bad for him. In the beginning, he actually gifted me fruit. And I was really mean to him right before. And I feel bad because I'm like, he's giving me things and I'm being really rude. You're giving me fencing. He said, fence yourself in and don't come out. Um... But yeah, I'll keep y'all updated on my leg thing. Um, Health-wise, everywhere else, I'm doing everywhere. Can I talk? My lord. Um, I'm doing pretty good. And I hope you guys are doing really well as well. In the U.S., we do have the plague going around. We got dengue going around. I know in other parts of the world, there's other diseases going around now as well. And that's just going to become our reality as the climate changes and as the world changes things develop so just stay safe be careful take care of those you love take care of yourself and that's all you can do okay ready one two three you know what it's okay i'm not mad these aren't the worst three starting villagers ever like it could have been a lot worse so i'm okay with that i'm okay with that we're just gonna be happy, you know? Um, I do think that is the end for this little short form video. I hope it was exciting enough. Again, it's just very chill. Just me here talking to y'all, having a good old time. 
um, and I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm probably going to do my next live stream on Animal Crossing also and just do like the campsite villager um, and villager hunting maybe, which is probably going to come before this video. Um, apologies if that's confusing or it might come after. I kind of have an inexplicable urge to play Sonic Frontiers or like something different. So we'll see how that goes. Again, thank you all so much for the support and everything else. I super duper appreciate you. And for 490 subs, if we're still at that number, even if we're not, if we're close, that's insane. That's freaking crazy. Thank you guys so much. Oh my God, look, me in the back. Um, Ew. Anyways, um, I'm going to go and get ready for work because I do work tomorrow. Tomorrow's Thursday. Um, my Friday slay because um, I am filming this on filming. Who am I, YouTuber? I am recording this on July. What the heck? 10th. I'm an idiot. So I will talk to you all very soon, I'm sure. Please take care of yourselves and happy time zones. I love you all and bye.